Okay, now that was a catastrophe, and I do not know why the sound out input from my uh, setup decided to change on its own. Because I was unmuted and everything, and I went through such a big old nonsensical thing. Anyway, let's try that again. Take two, everyone. Welcome back, everybody. It's Monday night, 7 p.m. EST, which means it's another mission on Mega Monday. Thank you guys for coming back, you navigators, operators, and spotters. I'm your host, Grensai, the king that can never truly die. There we go. That's everything you basically missed. Now we're in business. All right, last week we took down Mega Man Extreme 2 as the Reploid Rectifier, as our good guy, Cyber Blaster likes to call him, X. All right, so X's mission went through last week, and we enjoyed that. We got CK in the house. We got Maverick official in the house, ladies and gentlemen. If you don't know Maverick, Maverick has his own channel that he uh, does on Twitch. So after this, if you want to visit him, please go ahead and do that. Uh, Maverick, you can go throw your... Uh, you, you can plug yourself if you like. That's fine with me. And I will try to rate... You, are you going to be streaming tonight, Maverick? Because if you are, after my, after my run, I will... Hey yo, sound, yeah. If you're gonna be streaming tonight, I will raid everybody that's in here today over your way so they can check you out. How's that? So uh, you can you can plug yourself now if you like, but that, that's up to you. Today we're gonna take down, I'll be live 5 p.m., 8 p.m. EST, which is a little bit during our run of Mega, Ma Mega Mondays, but you guys can continue with his madness over there after we're done with our Maverick marauding. Uh, in any case, Cyber Blaster, unfortunately, uh, AKA Intro Man, will not be joining us today. He has been taken by the throat by his job unfortunately and i completely resonate with that that's uh unfortunate but gotta do the got what gotta 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 take care of what's important first so we are without an intro today but that's okay it's a little bit less work on my hands <laughs> so i'll take it but every one of his intros is indeed a treat so hopefully we'll get some more of intro man's magic in any case we are also going to be going through all of the robot, the Mavericks, using the Maverick Hunter Field Guide. Once again, for those of us who did not get to see the original incarnation and of these entries in Mega Mondays during the mainline game, we're going to revisit them for the extreme game. And I, I'm doing that because I believe we've had enough time divorced from the last time we've read it that we could use a second revisitation. Also, many of these entries have an additional blurb for the Soli Racer event. Uh, just a second, I need to power up. Back to business. In any case, um, there's not much to say. Last week, we took down Mega Man X Stream 2 with X, and we got the uh, Colonel Shadow X4. Yeah, he, he is dying for X4. And we got the New Game Plus, which lets us start the next mission with Zero, but... The cool benefit, and this is one of the cool parts about Mega Man X Stream on the Game Boy Color, Extreme 2 on the Game Boy Color, is that when you play as X, you fight a certain four Mavericks. And when you play as Zero, you fight another certain four Mavericks. And you get the abilities of the Mavericks you defeat. But if you are playing as Zero, you can't get the abilities from those four Mavericks that X is defeating, and vice versa. However, by doing New Game Plus, they award you with that new character. Uh, that, that new game plus, if you're going to start with zero, for example, you're going to get the four abilities for the Robot Master, the Maverick Hunter. I'm still doing Robot Masters. So many episodes of classic Mega Man stuck in my mouth. Uh, the Maverick's abilities for your new character for the new game plus, which is amazing. So now we're going to have eight moves, eight with zero. And zero plays a lot like he does in X4, which is an amazing feat for a Game Boy Color game, in my opinion. Excited to see the Extreme 2, though, never played it. Yeah, Maverick Official, I don't know how you've never played Extreme 2, but you gotta you gotta fix your life, sir. In any case, you're here to see what it's about, and we're gonna get into it right now. Uh, I don't think that there's any other preamble to... Oh. You know, what I wanted to do, and I forgot again, and I gotta apologize to you guys. I wanted to go through the Game Boy Color's uh, in instruction manual and all of its terrible, terrible translation errors like Garas and alias alias at least Belkana is spelled right now anyway uh, if you guys want to see what this is about you can google it they have all the instruction manuals for any game that you can imagine online somewhere I forgot where the repository is but it's really cool you can look through the pages and see what they did wrong and the nice art that they put into the game in any case I've said in any case a million times I think that's my new catchphrase today I've had a hard day myself. Cyber Blaster, my heart goes out to you. Let's get back to business and let's take the Sigma off the screen. Uh, I played the original Mega Man and X1 through 7 and Command Mission, missing lots. P. 
patiently waiting for the new X game. Bro, you're gonna die of old age for that new X game. I'm sorry. Sorry to say it. I don't see it coming. The new X game is gonna get X dive too, maybe, if we're lucky. Gotcha is the way of money, bro. Gotcha is the way of money. In any in any case, I swear to god. You know what? If I say in any case again, I'm gonna I'm gonna uh Donate to a charity, I, I guess. I don't know, a thing or something. Some way of penalizing myself in a pure-hearted way. I, I don't know yet. All right. Uh, gotcha. MMXD was my last mobile game. MMXD is the only gotcha that got into my wallet so hard. And you know what? It's because of my, my hopefulness, all right? I figured if I support Mega Man X with my wallet as hard as I did, Capcom would see the value in Mega Man and we'd get a new Mega Man X game. But the problem with that idea is that they would probably think, oh, it's the gotcha model that's making us money, not the IP. So let's just milk that horse. Cow. You can make horse you can milk horses. Anyway, wh whatever. We're not talking about animals. Has there ever been a horse maverick? I feel like that'd be a dope maverick. The closest I think I can think of is uh What was the deer again? I forgot. Mega Man X2. I forgot the deer. Man, I wasn't even that far away. And he's a dope boss. Flame Stag. There we go. Dope boss. There we go. All right. All right. So let's take this off the screen. And let's get into it. Got to fix my sound mixing. Again, I do apologize about that weird microphone hiccup. I don't know why it changed to some other microphone that... I don't even know where it was reaching for, but hey, hey, these things, they happen sometimes. Thank you guys for your patience. All right, let's get into it. Flame stack. Uh, by the way, I, I, I've, I've uh, raved about them before. Metal Tool and Flint, Stone McNuckle, they have some amazing remixes, and you gotta hear, I forgot which one of them did a remix for Flame Stag, but that is hype music, and if you need encouragement in the gym, listen to that! Oof! Okay. No, I didn't want to load that! <laughs> how do I, how do I un... There we go. You know, the, the soft reset on the Game Boy Color still works. Start select AB. I legit made an MMX, MMX, I legit made an MMX gym mix on my SoundCloud. You're dang right you did, because that's their greatest, like, soundtrack to go to the gym to. Okay, good, that's done. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Uh, here we go, Zero Mission. New Game Plus, let's go. Now, to preface things, especially for uh, viewers like Maverick Hunter, Maverick Official, the Soul Eraser event, basically there are Reploids who are suddenly having their programs erased and their memories are gone, leaving nothing but husks behind. Uh, so they found that there's something happening on Lagoo's Island, and that's where the origin of this problem is coming from, so they're going to investigate. So they want to know why these Mavericks, I'm sorry, these Reploids are losing their programming and just becoming husks. Uh, and as you can see, Iris is with them. For her very first mission, this is pre-Mega Man X4, uh, and she is a liaison between the, Rep the Repla Force and the Maverick Hunters. The Repla Force being, I'm sure you know all this, but I'm, I'm just prefacing for anybody that doesn't or is seeing Mega Man for the first time, which there are a couple of people like that in, in my stream, which uh, basically this stream is built for most of those newcomers. Anyway, so... The Repla Force is an army of Reploids that was created in response to the uprising of the Mega Man X3's whole Doppeltown incident. The uh, Doppeltown was a town of Mavericks, basically. And it was a huge problem that they their answer to that problem, should it ever happen again, is the Repla Force. Whereas the Maverick Hunters, as we all know, are like cops. So she is their liaison working with them on this mission, and here we are, we have Iris. Um... There is a Ma there is a Maverick Hunter field guide entry in Iris, but if you'd like to hear about that, you'd have to watch the previous episode. You can see that on YouTube, or still on Twitch, I think, right now for another couple hours. You are now on Lagoo's Island, where the Erasure incidents have happened. What's the situation? There? Also, the translation is not 100% in this game, but it's not terrible like in X-Dive. And I can't do female voices, so I'm not going to try very hard. I've found some Reploids that are out of commission. And the others have become mavericks. 
Iris, we will begin. We will. I hate the 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 the. the, the we will. We'll begin. You know that's how this should be. Uh, we'll begin to check the surrounding area. Can you offer support? Okay, but please don't get too wild and bite off more than you can chew. Don't worry, Iris. All right. So now we're gonna play as our. Ugh! So the first time we got to play as, as Zero was in Mega Man X3, which was, uh, I think, the game that we played before x 2, and you felt immediate power upon his entry. He came in, he broke the ceiling, his theme song blasts, and he's just got this posture of just kingliness, and he's just blasting things. He's got two charge slashes, uh, two charge blasts and a slash. It's just amazing. It's just amazing. And right here, we don't have a buster. Here, we just have the Z-Saber. All oh, right, and to dash, I forgot it's down or double or the command dash. All right, I got my bearings back. Let's get back into it. The command dash makes a big difference in mobility. Zero is evil. This is Colonel Shadow's madness. Now we have zero moves. I don't know how to execute them. Ah, right. And one of the best things about the Extreme game is that they have a partner system. You can actually switch between X and Zero as you get deeper into the game, which is amazing. How they introduced it in Game Boy Color and didn't introduce it again until X7, and they did a poor job in X7, is crazy. X8. Anyway. Zero, what's the situation? The Mavericks that we had destroyed before rampaging throughout the island. I almost said city. This has been hap what's been happening on this island? X, you check out the route below. Roger that. Stay alert, Zero. See you later. Isn't that how, M how MMX3 was? You could switch between them? No. In MMX3, you could switch between X and Zero once. Meaning you can go from X to Zero one time. And if you come across a boss door, even a, a mini boss door, Zero ports out and drops X in. You can't switch back to Zero. Also, if Zero dies, he's done for the rest of the game. Do I have an air dash? Oh, I do have an air dash. That's dope. Okay, up, a, up and attack does that. Awesome. I don't have a downward. I gotta check out what my moves are. Fish fang. What the? Try thunder and fire wave. What the heck was that? What did I get hit by? Right, I wanna know what fire wave does. No, not that. Okay. You press down and attack to get that to, that to move. Try Thunder. How do, okay, Try Thunder is you have to select it. Okay. And Fish Fang. I don't know what Fish Fang does. How does one Fish Fang? Does it even tell me? It doesn't. How do you do Fish Fang? Ah, crap. I'm not doing too hot with health. Okay. And I'm fashionably- Ah, Clamsian! One of our famous navigators. Ladies and gentlemen, Clamsian's joined the channel, and I'm getting my butt kicked because I'm trying to figure out Zero's moves. I now have a grasp on most of them, so hopefully I won't die. Oh, he comes back? Okay, I didn't know that. I got one point of health, and I gotta fight a boss. I'm not gonna make this. That's okay. I was learning. It's okay to get beat up while you're learning. <laughs> Why don't you come out and face me? Hey, Clamsy in! Alright, so yeah, I forgot about this boss. He's gonna give some- if you're- if you have light sensitivity, please look away for now. Because hitting him does this. Only this boss. A little sick of my heads. I can't believe I let him hit me! I was just two hits away from winning. I think this guy is called Skullhead or Skullface. I don't remember. But he's like so drastically departed from a regular mechanoloid. He had to be made specifically for this island by Belkana. Belkana. The, the bad translation made me think Belkana. Because in Japanese you don't have L's. So a lot of R's might be confused with L's. Okay. Okay, that move doesn't do anything for him. That's disappointing. You have to hit him with a regular attack. Okay, well, you know what? You're being a, a, a nuisance, sir. If 
goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. All right, intro stage done. Which, by the way, I gotta say, I'm still very happy that we have intro stages in Mega Man X games. It is crazy that they took intro stages out of later classic games. Like, they introduced them in 7, and then in 11, there was no intro stage. How? Intro stages are amazing. Even in Powered Up, we had an intro stage. Are you all right? Let's go up for now, so that we can contact Iris. Agree, but I wonder what they are up, are plotting. I wonder what they are up to. You know, I, same, same words. I, I gotta assume what I'm gonna read if I wanna stay, like, without sounding like a robot. Because the way that the words come up. X! Zero! We've just received! I love that Zero just like, shut up, I'm talking. What is it, Iris? She's gonna tell you! <laughs> is it you? Who has broken into my island? Who are you? I am a soul eraser. I erase the souls of evil mavericks. That can't be. What do you really do? It takes courage to ask a some to ask someone like me a question like that. It was just a regular question. Interesting. Well then, let's play a little game. There are eight guardians on this island. Retire all of them, and then I will battle. These silly games are pointless! It seems that retiring eight might be easier than persuading one. <laughs> you are very quick, Zero. My name is Gareth. Don't forget it. Gareth? I can't find any data on such a reploid in our databases. Plus, we have found unfamiliar items. We've also found DNA data that was draining out of the enemies. They seem to have been resurrecting enemies by somehow utilizing DNA. They're erasing the Reploid's DNA in order to create items? She didn't say anything like that, but all right, Zero. It seems so. A Reploid's DNA is like that of a human soul. From now on, let's call a DNA soul. Let's call it a DNA soul. We may be able to create something useful for Maverick's DNA souls. We can't leave Maverick's souls alone. We must also find the souls of the erased Reploids. Let's gather the DNA souls. So like I said, the uh, it, so far I haven't seen as bad of a translation as in the first one. But it's still kind of like crunchy. Like it's not fluid English. Okay, so this time we have a set of four Mavericks. That is Wire Sponge, Blast Hornet, Overdrive Ostrich, and Tunnel Rhino. Ah, I did it by memory this time. Clams, are you proud of me? All right, let's see what parts we got available to us to buy. We have created a new part. All right, so it doesn't look like any of the parts that I purchased in the original game carried over to the Zero game, which is very, very disappointing. So I have no incentive to buy the X parts until I start to use X, which is much later. So let's buy the Zero parts. Let's get that Z Saber Plus. Yes, please. Oh, and the ultimate saber super slide. I don't know what it means. I don't know what it does, but I want it. Yes, I'm sure, Iris. Don't question me. Uh, I want the barrier extender. Absolutely. Uh, super recover. Sure. And energy saver. Now, you can only equip four parts at a time, so I'm going to have to make some tough choices. But it doesn't mean I don't like buying everything. All right. So, I am taking votes. And if, not, and if nobody has any votes for me, I will randomly decide, probably from going from left to right. So, does anybody have a suggestion for the first Maverick to take down? Just as, well, this is a different scenario. We're not playing as X, and we don't have the generic gotta bounce, unfortunately, and get ready for my stream, but awesome stream, bro. I love the overlay, classic look. Have a great shift. Maverick, take it easy. Enjoy. Thanks for dropping by. Sorry I didn't really get into the action, but uh, hopefully next time you'll see something. Now, let's see. In the original runs that I've been doing on Mega Monday it's all good bro catch you next time okay. I've been playing as X and X has his weaknesses available to him via collecting like changing the, the burial weapon system but with zero their techniques so with zero I'm actually not going to restrict myself as long as I'm not cheesing so I won't cheese a move but if it's like makes sense to do it because I'm in air and I want to smack something well, I'm gonna do it all right, so since I've got no votes on what Maverick to take down, I'm going to go with Wire Sponge.
I'm already like trying to. Oh, I found a, a, a health, a heart tank. So, oh, very nice. Okay. Can I turn it back? No, I don't want to just. Yeah, thank you. Okay, so yeah. I can't get. I don't have a double jump, but I have an air dash. Nice song. It is. Uh, so in uh, this, in Mega Man Extreme 2, there are two sub tanks in the entire game, and you can only get one per campaign. Whoa. Until the final campaign when you get the full eight Robot Master. Rup, eight Maverick roster. And lo and behold, there, no, 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 bro, 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 Oh my god, I'm gonna die. I am my own worst enemy. Okay, so we got the sub tank. Okay. Not what I expected. I remember having to go up. Oh, there's nothing here, really. Okay. I like that the Maverick, like the, the, the enemies that you defeat don't come back just because you come off the screen. What's down below? I want to see if there's a down. No, there's no down! I don't think there's a down anyway. Very nice. Whoa. Ah. ah, jerk. Whoa! You know what? I'm just gonna leave that. Dang. Alright. Nice! Oh, you know what I forgot? I forgot to click some parts. Alright, so I want that. I don't know what the ultimate saber is, but I want it. Barrier extender and oh, zero can only click can can only wear three A parts. Okay, so Naked X can wear four, Armored X can wear two, and Zero can wear three. Hmm. Uh, I'll take off the barrier extender and put the there we go. I didn't want to do that. Change the weather. I I don't even understand. I thought it was over land. I messed that up. So the problem with those fish is that I am not like if I press even a little up or down, those fish are going to come out when I swing in air. Okay. I don't even know if there's capsules or something in every stage for Zero. I feel like there wouldn't be. I already had a boss door. Alright, boss door. So we're at Wire Sponge. There he is on screen, everybody. Wire Sponge! I don't know my alphabets. Where, uh, where does the W come? Uh, there we go. Wire Sponge! Aliases Wire Hetimaro. Also known as the Little Demon of the Green Forest. Affiliation Mavericks Sigma. Weapon Strike Chain Lightning. Known weaknesses Sonic Slicer and Fire Wave. So I have his weakness because I have the Fire Wave. Wire Sponge was created in one of the robotics factories used by Sigma to produce more Mavericks for his army, with the purpose of helping the former Maverick Hunter conquer the humans. However, an accident saw to it that his combat capabilities were tempered by a personality disorder which saw him develop a playful, childish nature and a love for dancing. Sigma saw to it that Sponge was stationed at a weather control center, 
where he could pass the time by wreaking havoc on weather systems. Though childish, Wire Sponge was nevertheless still violent and attacked X upon his entry into the facility. His primary weapon, the Strike Chain, was used in a variety of ways. Not only could Sponge deflect attacks by spinning it before him, but he could also lash out with it its with its barbed end at anyone interrupting his playtime. He could also use it to pull himself to the ceiling, dispensing mechanical seedlings from his head that would sprout pointy vines on the floors and ceilings. When things get desperate for him, Sponge charged himself with energy and called down lightning strikes as he danced. Temporarily immune to any attacks, he used most of the same tactics against Zero when he was revived by Rikana and Gareth, but with seeds that exploded instead of growing vines. Yeah, well, good, that, thank you for letting me know that difference. When X defeated Sponge, he adapted the strike chain into his arsenal, allowing him to fire a hooked chain wire to attack foes, retrieve items, and even pull himself toward walls. Charging the weapon would produce a longer and more powerful strike chain. When Sponge was DNA resurrected during the Erasure incident, Zero gained, would gain the lightning technique. This is called lightning. Allowing him to call down several balls of electricity around him, just as Sponge would. Very cool. All right, let's take him off the screen, the, the screen, and take him off the scene. Man, I keep trying to like dash with R, and it's just not a thing. Let's go, Wire Sponge. Okay, so they do just explode. You know what? I feel like. Oh wait, the one on the wall doesn't didn't explode. Ah, bro. Okay, I'm getting hurt. Okay, so sometimes they, they, um, they plant. They don't always explode. Oh, no. There goes his invincible form. Is he invincible the whole time he's red? Oh, no, he's not. Cool. One and done. I used his weakness one time just because I was trying to get a distance attack because I wasn't sure if he was invincible or not. I don't think that was cheating. Bite me. Red just means angry. Ah. You got lightning. Alright, do we have a vote for the next one, ladies and gentlemen? Let's take over the cards while we wait. We don't have anything. Ultimate Buster! Charge shot. I don't care what it is, I'm buying it. Alright, with no votes, we're gonna go for Blast Hornet. Hornet. Let's see how his song sounds in this Game Boy Color. I like the sky, the spy copter in the background. Warning, warning. Very cool. Okay, cool. Well, I was a little greedy, but also I was like curious if there was more to the right. Oh. Oh, the spy copters are like something you actually deal with in this game. That's cool. Oh, thank God I landed on the platform because I almost died. Overdrive Ostrich next is the vote I'm getting from CK. I'm exploring. Sorry. They're a little smaller than I remember in their cutscene. I don't know what to look for. I feel like there's something here. This is like a good spot to hide something. Nice. 
Nice. Well, I didn't find anything, but uh, hopefully I didn't miss anything. We at least know for a fact that there's a heart tank in every stage. And I've already got the sub to Ow! I've already got the sub tank, so we don't need to worry about- Oh no! That was scary! I wonder, is there- How do I do this? Do I just- Okay, it's just- I like that that thing's like- Immortal. jerk no 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 no! oh wait there was a down oh -ho! no wait 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 oh scary all right well that was a scary little thing that happened i'm going back if there's a down oh oh wait wait wait, wait. no i have been betrayed i thought there was ground Okay, well, we found a little secret area. I don't... Alright, let's be more careful this time. Ah, we got the heart tank! There we go, we're good! Very well hidden. That, and I feel like that was fairly done, like... I don't know. That didn't seem too, it, like, too unreasonable. Oh! Go! Whoa! Oh, that's a ceiling. Can we go up, please, sir? Thank you. Oh! Woohoo! Ah! Ah, jerk! I didn't mean a du I didn't mean a command dash. How are you supposed to do this? Oh, that's how. I got like no weapon energy. Can we drop some weapon energy for Gren, please? And thank you. Ask it, you shall receive. That was a lucky catch. Or was it skill? You'll never know. Well, that's the wrong way. Wait, I want to see if there's more this way. No, there's not. Let's go. Wait, maybe we got to touch the wall. Nope, let's go. That move needs to be stronger. I'm very disappointed in the strength of that move. Why doesn't he combo? Oh, he doesn't combo because the part, if I'm not mistaken. I think I'm gonna take the the super part, right? Like if I take that off, I think he combos, right? Yeah. So my combo goes away because this is supposed to be like a super heavy one slash. I rarely do combos in this game anyway. Ow! Yay, whip energy! Ah! Whoa! Alright, that's not fair. What? Not what I expected. Alright, we're at the boss already! Wait, 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 this does not look like a boss room. Oh! Okay. Ah. I tried to do the eraser, I tried to hit the eraser. Ah. You are not being very fair. Ah! Ha! I 
can't wait till I get my downward slash. Like the, the drive down attack. Now this is a boss door. Alright. So we are here fighting Blast Hornet. That's... There goes Blast Hornet on the screen, everyone! And the Rover Master, the Maverick Hunter Field Guide. One day I'll get those those blasted robots out of my mouth. Maverick Hunter Field Guide entry on Blast Hornet reads aliases. Explose Hornet, also known as the Flying Spy of Shadows. Affiliation Mavericks, Doppeltown, formerly of the Maverick Hunters. Weapon Parasitic Bomb. Known weaknesses weapons that can disrupt his flight. Such as Gravity Well and Sonic Slicer. I don't think I have Sonic Slicer or Gravity Well. Once the second in command of the Covert Maverick Hunter Special Zero Class Unit, Shinobi, which is also the unit that Zero heads, Blast Hornet went to Doppeltown in place of his commander, Zero, whose presence had been requested by Dr. Doppler. While there, a new spread of the Maverick virus infected him, turning him Maverick and causing his defection to Doppler's army where he was put in charge of guarding a weapons factory. He was defeated by X, but, res but resurfaced as one of the Reploids revived by the Soul Erasers at Magoo's Island. There, he fought and lost to his former commanding officer, Zero. His data went on to be further used to attack those who intruded upon the lair of Metal Shark Player. During the Nightmare Incident, so we'll, read we'll learn about that later. Blast Hornet usually attempted to make the first strike with his stinger. But, his primary weapon, the Parasitic Bomb, would fire a barrage of hornet-shaped drones from his abdomen, which latched onto their target and inflicted damage before exploding. When pressed, Hornet activated his targeting system, which allowed a smaller number of Parasitic Bombs to hunt down his prey. When X defeated Hornet, he gained a Parasitic Bomb of his own. While his normal version was a four-pronged projectile, charging the weapon saw it resume its normal shape. Zero's victory acquired him a version of the Earth Glaze Earth Geyser, in which he punched the ground, sending forth a devastating wave of destructive force. I don't know how he gets that move from defeating Blast Hornet, but okay, go you, Zero. Take him off the screen and off the scene. You got it, CK. Let's go. Let's see how hard he is in this one. Okay, well, I am making a fool of myself. Well, Zero does amazing damage. It's probably because that part that I have attached to him. His little hornets look so angry. They look like angry Goombas with like little pincers that can fly. That was not very difficult. That was too easy. That was too easy. You were harder in the original. I don't really, I don't really blame them for making some of these bosses not that hard, especially after Extreme One with freaking what's his name, Spark Mandrel. Oof, that guy was rough. Because it is a Game Boy Color game. It's more compact. It's a quick in and out kind of feeling. They have been very entertaining. It's unwise to allow them to act on this island. They should be terminated immediately. Not yet. I want the data on the Maverick Hunters. The more they fight, the stronger they would become. Thus, better data would be acquired. We've acquired enough data, DNA cells. We don't need any more. You must have noticed how dangerous it is to fight both of them at the same time. True. It is too dangerous to fight them at once. Fight them both at once, Gareth! Let's enjoy watching them for a while. One of the Guardians may even get lucky and destroy them. It is very unlikely, but if you say so, I can hardly wait to meet them. I like Verkana. I wish that we got, uh... I wish they made, like, a, a not a Game Boy Color version of this game. That would be a really dope experience. A really nicely fleshed out version of this game. Ah, beautiful. 
All right, we already got a vote for Overdrive Ostrich. If anybody has any other votes that they want to put through, I'm all ears. We have no new parts, so I'm just going to buy this. Buster plus two. So we can make the Buster, like, plus three if we wanted. Speed shot. So good, so good. Speed shot is the best. Buying X parts, even though I have no X right now. Alright, taking down Overdrive Ostrich, and it looks like we still get a Ride Chaser, ladies and gentlemen. I do not even know what my button for the Ride Chaser graphic is, but uh, I'll figure it out. I have no idea. <laughs> I'll have to go to the main console and like actually manually load it up. We'll get there when we get there. Overdrive Ostrich! Uh, they're faithful to the original incarnation and immediately they give you the ride chaser all right so i'm gonna have to load up the ride chaser we're gonna find out where i put it uh ride armor chimera ride chaser cheval there we go that is the first ride chaser ladies and gentlemen and the first time we got to see this was in x2 which Overdrive Ostrich's stage is in Mega Man X2. So that was one of their proudest achievements in the X2 game, I'm assuming. So they wanted to bring it back. And dude, why not? Ride Chasers are dope, <laughs> right? Let's see what we have here in the Maverick Hunter Field Guide about Ride Chasers. And the X route, we had the Ride Armor, the Rabbit, EG2 Custom. But here, we have the ADU T400 Turbo Cheval. AKA Mobile Attack Cycle. In addition to being armed with a front mounted buster, this model lived up to its name by incorporating a turbo boost feature to allow for high speed action. However, it was also incredibly fragile when compared to later models, making the added speed a risk to use. Maverick reconnaissance reploids known as Road Riders rode Chevals through Overdrive Ostrich's desert base, complementing the onboard buster with their own thrown bomb. A similar model was found on Lagoos Island, but the buster weapon system was disabled and a dash attack function was added in its place. Alright, so I got no weapon. That's a little bit of a disappointment. Alright. Let's take it off the screen. Alright, back to business. Alright. I wonder if I could just... Oh no, they don't even let you skip. You have to get on this ride chaser. Oh, there's a blade! There's a blade! There's a jump. Alright, uh, that wasn't fun. Oh! Ah! This is a little clunky to use. It's a little clunky. He said that this is dash. I wonder if that's down and jump. Is it down jump? No, it's not down jump. What if it's double jump? Double forward. There's no double forward. They said it's a dash! There's no dash! There's a blade! Ah! Scare! Alright, this is very, very difficult. Because, uh, it's not as fluid as it appears like it would be. Alright, we'll get used to it. We'll get used to it. And as soon as you do the blade, you start to descend. So you can't really, like, attack on a whim. Ah! As soon as you hit the blade, you descend, Grin. So why would you do that over a giant gap?! <laughs> You fool! Alright, this is difficult. There are people that, like, literally hate this. Like, they, I, and I get it, because, like, this is... You're, you're here for a platform. But, yo, this is part of the game, bro. Just get good. Yeah, okay, that was very... And that was very short. That was very short. Get from the last guy? Alright, it was Earthquake. I want to see what this looks like. Earth Geyser. Room. Okay, let's go. I don't know why Zero needs to port in to do it, but there you go. I'm afraid to walk in during that. Oh! More ride chasers in the background. Nope. Give me those shibals! Okay, that is an instant kill. I thought it might have just been like a little push up. Kind of like in 
launch Octopus's stage. That's an instant kill. There's nothing that telegraphs that that's gonna murder you in one hit. Very disappointment. Whoop, scary. Why did I get hit there? I hit him. My blade was out. Ah, oh, well. Ah. You know what? Considering that these things were a thing all the way in X1, those little mechanoids that look like boars, the inception of Ride Borski just makes a lot of sense. I was trying to get something off my screen. Let's go! Yeah! <laughs> Whoa! There's two of them! That is part of the problem when the, the jump button is, an, is a dash button in air. Because I, I kind of like ju like panic double tap the jump button because I wanted to get out of that that, that attack. There's not enough sc screen crunch. It's, it's, there's not enough screen space to see what's coming. Ow! Ah, well. Ah! I don't think that these things are a good gimmick for this stage, to be honest. Bro! Command dash, command dash. You disappoint, command dash! You can't edge forward. You inch forward, you end up just dashing to your death. It's very painful. Ah! Touching the directional, afraid. Hands off. <laughs> you disappoint Baldy. Ah, oh, he's back! Ladies and gentlemen, one of the best navigators around. Baldy! How you doing, brother? Thank you for joining us tonight. Dr. Light, enter this capsule. Take this head crush. This head upgrade will allow you to crush certain blocks. So am I to understand that there's a capsule on every stage? Because I, 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 this is the first capsule and this is the third stage. There was a capsule on every stage for X, but is there a capsule on every stage for Zero? There has to be! Oh no, we gotta go back! <laughs> Clemson! Red just means angry. Where's Clemson when I need him? I need a navigator to find the rest of the capsules for me. You're gonna have to go back. Oh, more ride chaser. This is not gonna be fun. Oh, scary. It, it does not move the way you think it does. It was a downward path! That was the- Ah, oh, we gotta go back! Doesn't matter, I died. Womp womp. Uh, I could quit the game and just load- You know what? I'm gonna cheat a little bit. I used to do this when I was a kid. Yeah, you do the autosave. That'll put me right where the, uh... There we go. And do I still have my armor piece? I think I do, right? Yeah, I do, baby! All right! Small cheat, small cheat. 
scary, man. This thing does not move the way you think it does. Go down, go down. Bro, uh, how, how are you supposed to go in the hole? That's disappointing, because I, I, I don't... I don't know what to do, because I, I, I... You just fall... Am I supposed to jump early and then, like, fall in there? Because I just held forward, hoping he'd go in there, and he just did not. He just got crushed. He went down. I do not like the way that this thing works at all. Arr. I'm also not a fan of this death tornado. Like, it is just wasting my time. Blast Hornet, Wire Sponge, Tunnel Rhino, Overdrive, Ostrich. Yes. I don't know what that means, but yes. Those are the, those are the Mavericks I'm fighting. Sup, Punk? Have a good sh- Oh, man, ciao! Bees is here, ladies and gentlemen. Enjoy your D&D, buddy. Thanks for popping by. Whoa. Scary. That was extra scary. We already have that piece, right? Good, I got to keep it. I just wanted to make sure. I wasn't sure. I just had to make sure. Can I skip it? No, I can't skip it. I'd much rather walk this, please and thank you. I'm gonna die so many times trying to get that heart tank. It's not fair. I'm gonna jump ahead of time. That's gonna be like, that's gotta be the answer. Jump! Oh, that was the answer! Oh, that was the answer. Listen, whoever designed this bike to descend when you attack, Horrible! Horrible! Also, if you press forward while you jump, it just, it maintains, it maintains momentum until it hits the ground. It is the hardest thing in the world to control. I'm gonna make sure I get extra air when I do the jump ones. Alright, we did it. Thank God it wasn't that long. Hopefully this is a real boss door. I'm tired of being G'd. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. We are at Overdrive Ostrich. There he is on the screen, ladies and gentlemen. Overdrive Ostrich. So what does the Maverick Hunter Field Guide say about our Ostrich boy? L-M-N-O-P-Q-R-S-T. L-M-N-O-P-Q-R-S-T. Oh my god. L-M-N-O. My o is not as far back in the alphabet as you think. M-N-O. Overdrive Ostrich. Aliases Sonic Australia 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 I don't know what that word is. Also known as the Swift Runner of the Sandy Plains. At least I could read that. Affiliation Mavericks Sigma, formerly of the Maverick Hunters. Weapon Sonic Slicer. Known weaknesses Crystal Hunter, Strike Chain, and Zero's Lightning Skill. Ooh, we have that. Overdrive Ostrich was once a Maverick Hunter of the 7th Airborne Unit. Unlike his biological brethren, Overdrive Ostrich was once an accomplished flyer. Mm -hmm. So ostriches cannot fly, but he used to fly. That doesn't make sense. Who designed him as an ostrich? Unfortunately, an accident robbed him of his ability to fly. Good, that's ostriches should not be flying. But his blinding speed and stunning leaping prowess more than made up for his loss of his flight capabilities. Yeah, he's really fast. Sigma was impressed with Overdrive Ostrich's agility and invited him to join his Maverick army. The Big Bird accepted, appreciative of the recognition Sigma heaped on him. He was stationed at an abandoned missile base and ordered to launch the single warhead remaining in the desolate place. He even succeeded at getting the missile into the air, but Mega Man X thankfully brought it down before it could reach the stratosphere. Good job, us! Overdrive Ostrich's personal chamber was situated outdoors and it was far larger than the average battlefield X navigated when he fought other Mavericks. It's true, it was a whole gang desert. 
Robo Drive Ostrich remained out of the X's reach and ran alongside him, unbothered by the desert dunes. Once he homed in on X, he'd make an epic high jump and try to land on the hunter's head. Another fighting technique involved launching boomerang like Sonic Slicer Blades at targets, sometimes as a single shot and other times as a much larger, as much larger blades that flew up into the air and rained back down. Overdrive Ostrich was fond of using his powerful legs as a weapon. As weapons too. He could use his charge to run down opponents and one running steps kick could send X flying halfway across the battlefield. That's true, I remember that. He'd kick you and you go... Once defeated, Overdrive Ostrich surrendered the Sonic Slicer for X's own use. This weapon shot a small succession of blades that were slow to accelerate but could ricochet off walls and devastate certain targets when they made contact. Wire Sponge, for example, learned about Sonic Slicer's power the hard way when the weapon sliced him in two. Charged up, the Sonic Slicer fired several large blades into the air, wherefrom they rained back down. When the Hunters fought the DNA Resurrected Overdrive Ostrich during the Erasure Incident, Zero gained Dash, an ability that let him dwarf dart forward with his Z-Saber draw. I feel like I can do that already. I gotta see what the, that's actually doing. Let's see what it's about. And let's take the Ostrich off the screen and off the sea. Let me fix my posture just a wee bit. Okay, buddy. I was fixing my posture. Can't be giving you my attention. Okay, so this still has a little bit of a bigger arena than usual, but it's still kind of small. And that's probably because... You know... Game Boy Color. I just want to see if he has a reaction to the lightning. No, he doesn't. He just takes damage. Disappointment. Super easy, zero too strong. It's probably the ultimate buster making it holding. Ultimate blade making it too strong. Blast Hornet for chest. Oh! Oh, wait, so those are armor parts for X. I thought they were for zero. Did that make, that does make sense. It didn't look like it was zero's uh, silhouette. Thank you, Baldi. <laughs> we're gonna have to go back, it sucks. I didn't think that there were capsules. I wasn't really looking for capsules. All right. Are there any new parts? No. No, there aren't. Yes, I am sure, Iris. Please and thank you. All right, let's take down Tunnel Rhino. We'll go back and do cleanup later. Wait, did we get a hard tank there? Yes, we did. All right. There's no vote, CK, but thank you. <laughs> this is the last option. I now I gotta explore everywhere because there might be a castle ahead. Ah! Oh, they do drop stuff. Thank you. I appreciate that. Every hole is a potential hiding spot. When am I going to get the... Oh, my God! When am I going to get the... That's not what I meant to do. What does the dash do? Oh, wow. Okay. That's a dumb move. Don't know if I like the chip tune version of this song. Yeah, this, not, this one's not it. I appreciate that it's still kind of like a... True to the original, though. Oh. Ah, dang, those things hit hard. This clearly looks like there's a path that way. I'm very disappointed. Thank you, I needed that. I'm hurting. Whoa. Nope. Blah! Okay, buddy. He just turned off my flame. Oh, he still got me with the mortar. I, uh, I hate those things. Have I told you guys that? I hate them. 
wonder if that's if that's gonna give me enough air. Nope. I gotta check every hole. out the way I expected. I hate those machines. I'm glad they only ever existed in X3 in this game. I hate them. Whoa! Whoa! We got another rabbit on our hands. Now, I'm not going to read the entry on the rabbit because we read that on X's run through. So there's no need. Thank God for that help. These other right armors don't stand a chance. They go down in one hit. Oh, well, I found something. There's definitely something to the left, so I'm probably going to go back. Bro, don't mess up my right armor. I don't know how to get back otherwise. All right, you know what? Bye, I'm out. Oh, wait, the right armor can fly. I forgot. No, 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 no. Get back in the right armor, bro. <laughs> I forgot that this right armor, the rabbit, has a little bit of a booster pack. Bro, what am I, what am I supposed to hit this with? What am I supposed to hit this with? I don't even have enough weapon energy to hit it with all the things I have. What am I supposed to do? There's <laughs> not enough energy for the Earth Geyser! This, oh, this is dumb! What am I supposed to do? It's lightning? Well, I got no energy for lightning. Maybe one of these guys will give me some weapon energy. How is there not a weapon energy tank? Ah, uh, and now I'm very disappointed that enemies don't respawn. How do you guys are all so stingy? Give me some weapon energy. Oh, <laughs> uh, this is terrible. This is terrible. This is terrible. I'm gonna... All right, fine. that give me that and that and we're gonna pop ourselves why not pop, 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 pop. all right one of you guys has to drop some weapon energy like yeah you have to no nobody nobody wants to drop weapon energy for Gren Fine, I'll cut. I'll just come back. Cowards. Good, full weapon energy. That's that's wonderful. Or straight. Ah! Wow. I hate these machines. Ah! I forgot there's nothing on this one. It's this one. I deserve that. Stupid, stupid drills. I'm out. Screw you. Oh, 
Okay, got me. Thank you. Boom, let's go. Coward. What? Okay. Baldi says lightning. Bro, lightning did nothing. I think it's Earth Geyser. No. Baldi says lightning. It has to be lightning if Baldi says lightning. Maybe it just has to hit. Wow! You have to get lucky! It is so... That is bad design. That one's bad design. Also, there's nothing that... that like, why would you think lightning it, at all? Enter this capsule. Take this zero final. This is the most powerful weapon and will destroy almost any enemy. I feel like these are for zero. I don't feel like these are for X. I got you, homie. Yeah, see, so I got zero final. What did the other one do? They are for zero. So what did the head part do? Giga Crush? I don't remember what it said. Oh, well. I have the zero final now. That's what matters. look like they're wearing the hawk version of the armor which is control alt h if you guys were curious how much of zero the x1 helm ahead button oh that's nice The light doesn't say anything to Like, just get in here and take this thing. And be happy about it. Oh, heaven! Okay, well, that was an unexpected event. Ah! Right in the face. Right in the kitchen. I still didn't get the heart tank, I realize. Whoa, whoa, whoa! How come he can survive lava? Worst mechanoloid ever. Ah! Bro, please stop being a thing. I'm not playing this game. You are a jerk, sir. Okay, we didn't get the heart tank though. Where the heck was the heart tank? We're gonna have to come back. Ah oh, man. There's a lot of redoing in this game. And oof, disappointment. Alright, here we are. Tunnel Rhino. There he is, ladies and gentlemen. And let's see what Tunnel Rhino's entry has to say for him. Alright. Tunnel Rhino. Alias is Screw Masadi Masider, also known as the Barbarian of Earth's Depths. That is a killer title. Affiliation, Mavericks, Doppeltown. Weapon, Tornado Fang. Known weaknesses, Acid Burst, Bombi, and Earth Geyser. Ooh, I have that. Before receiving an invitation to Doppeltown, Tunnel Rhino worked as an Energen Crystal Miner. Couldn't tell. After he arrived and turned Maverick, Dr. Doppler ordered him to put his skills to use by occupying a rock quarry and wreaking havoc. After being tracked down, Rhino engaged X by charging at him, Drillhorn first, with enough force to knock the hunter from the wall if he wasn't careful. Rhino also attempted to stab him with the much larger drill on his arm. And as, a battle, and as the battle progressed, Rhino entered into a seemingly invulnerable state as he charged. 
he also deployed his primary weapon, Tornado Fang! By either firing the drills on his arms and shoulders in three separate directions, or by splitting the one on his arm into three separate stacked drills in one direction. When Zero confronted the resurrected Rhino during the Eraser incident, his charge was now capable of kicking rubble and debris behind him at the Hunter. That's mean. X's victory gained him use of the Tornado Fang, a drill-shaped missile capable of piercing otherwise impregnable walls that could also be charged for an arm-mounted drill. Battling the revived Rhino during the Erasure incident saw X acquire a slightly modified version of the weapon which fired three drills at a time. Meanwhile, Zero learned the Drill Crush, a technique wherein the blade of the Z-Saber spun like a drill as he thrusted it down from the air. Ah, the downward attack! Finally! The thing I've been after forever! Where's Rhino? He's number six here. Alright, let's take him off the screen and off the scene. Goodbye, Rhino. Alright, he, he immediately opens up with that t tornado tunnel. T tornado, whatever the heck. I don't know what it's called, I forgot. Tornado Fang, I, I did it, I remembered. Ow! Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh! Ah! I wanted to use his weakness just because I wanted to see. Earth Geyser! That did a good amount of damage. Hey, that's what they were talking about with that debris. Did not see that coming. But you sleep now. And hopefully forever this time, Tunnel Rhino. ba da ba da ba da Thank you, CK. You got Trill Crush. Gareth. Splendid. I'll be waiting for you in the Reploid Research Laboratory. You know where that is. I'll put an end to this soon. Wait a second. I believe the laboratory is a very dangerous place. I know, but we have to go. Yes. I'm not going to stop you, just please take this device. With this device, you can execute a player change at any time by pressing select. All right, I all right, Iris. I'll trust his unknown potential power. Let's go, X. I'll get the DNA souls back. You're going down, Solar Racer. All right, now we got X on our team. Yay! That's almost a full grid. All right. Now, we didn't get the heart tank there. I'm next to certain about it. And I have no idea where it would be. Unless it's on the upward path that I fell down from when uh, I was riding the right armor. We got the... We got the... Yeah, this is where we got the first armor part. So we got to go back to these two guys to get their armor parts. All right, let's take a look at X. There he is, our boy X. He got no special weapons. None! Alright, let's give him this and this and, 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 and what is this? Ultimate Buster? I don't know what that is. Why is X only able to. Oh, because he's armored X already, isn't he? I want to see what this does. Yeah, he's fully. This is the best thing in the world! <laughs> You can't charge up, though, but it's just all charge shots. <laughs> That's insane. Let's see, a plus two charge shot. Does it change colors? No, but it looks a little bigger. Am I imagining that? No, it's, I was imagining that. That's crazy. I don't feel like he needs anything but that. I don't know. I'll just do this. Red shots! Woo! Okay. This... Yeah, that... that... That weather was to have making the the Game Boy Color chug. I was not having a good time with that. Let's 
nothing here. Yeah. We gotta be a little bit more meticulous, because we totally missed our... I'm gonna sacrifice a life potential. Oh! Well, I found the... I found the... I found the capsule. I thought I checked this. I did the little spot check, but the thing didn't go down. I did this, and it didn't go down. I have to, like, literally, like, commit. Enter this capsule. Take this leg crush. This upgrade would allow you to crush certain blocks. Thank you, old man who has not introduced himself to me. I'm kind of disappointed that the parts page is just X and silhouette instead of zeros. All right. Hey, Colonel, any, any, how's, did you make any chicken tendies today? found the heart tank here. It was very well hidden, but where is the capsule? That is the question. Alright, that was a crazy risk that I was taking right there. Ah, you jerks! Risky! There was a wall there. I should have just threw myself at it. Curiosity! Cowards! That does not look like a drill. That's supposed to be a drill? Yus! Coward! Alright, let's see what's going on here. Nothing, 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 nothing. I am super disappointed in this. I thought I was cool. Nice. DNA! Is there a higher point? No, this is the highest point I can get to. Ah, coward. Yep, nothing. Alright, so there's definitely no capsule in this first area. Let's get going. I feel confident in my check for this area. This was the heart tank, so we don't need to check that twice. Ah! There's no wall to the left, that's disappointing. Ah! Coward. Oh, no, no. Well. Yeah, the weapon half energy thing for zero makes so much sense. Why did I do that? Just wanted to check. Up, buddy, up. I'll never know if Colonel Bob's chicken tenders came out okay today. All right, let's see if there's anything over here. Probably nothing, but yeah, that was a waste. I kind of really do like that the uh, enemies don't respawn, but that's a problem for farming if you ever wanted to farm. Get back, coward! I wonder if I should have kept going up. Let's go up forever! What is in the unknown? Nothing, nothing is up there. I was pretty getting crushed. 
Maybe I. Yeah, maybe don't be. Maybe don't be scared this time, Brent. Okay. Coward. Nice. Double nice. All right. It has to be around here. Oh no. Heck yeah! That downward attack is the killer! I love it! Whoa! I like that it doesn't take weapon energy, too. That is not a drill, that is lightning! Okay, that got totally turned off. Whoa! No, the capsule had to be up there! That had to be it. There's no way to kill myself. These jerks! All right, I'm gonna ch just check. I'm pretty sure the capsule was up there. I wasn't supposed to pop that. It's the only place that I haven't been able to check. Ah, coward. I want the shot eraser. Alright, if there's no spot here that makes sense for a capsule, then yeah, it was definitely in that area. Yeah, it was definitely in that area. Ah, uh, we gotta go through this a whole nother time! Alright, let's try that again. Alright. Who would think to not, like, destroy that thing? Like, they don't even give you a chance to, like, choose not to go that way. We're gonna go through this real quick. Jerk. No! I didn't realize that was the spar! <laughs> I forgot. See, that's how, like, not cons like, not obvious that is. Okay, so now I know where not to kill. Alright, Grant, just go on a pacifistic run at this point. Jesus. Ow. Except for that jerk who hit me. Like, there's nothing conspicuous about that at all. Like, you would just think, I'll oh, just kill this enemy because he's shooting. Why not? Ah, fish sticks. That DNA said, uh, they made up for it. They gave me another pack. All right, don't kill anything after you get off into the back into the interior. Room. Remember that. Ow.
Don't break that guy. Let them live. There it is. I don't know what I'm supposed to hit this with, but let's try lightning. Because that always seems to work. It, it did not work. It, it didn't work two times. Let's try Earth Geyser. Okay, well, who would have thought Tunnel Rhino? Enter this capsule. I'll increase your defensive ability and you'll receive less damage. Thanks, Doc. Ah, Magus is in the house! Thanks for coming by, Magus. Alright, we have all the parts this time. Except for the heart tank. Find that heart tank in Tunnel Rhino stage. After that, we can take down Gareth. Oh, fish sticks! Oh boy! I hate that mechanoloid. Everything about that mechanoloid is messed up. Idea where this heart tank would be. I missed that headpiece from Mega Man X2, was it? Where it like told you where the things are. Ah! God, I hate that mechanoloid. Stupid boulder! I don't know why I feel the need to destroy all these boulders, but I do. God, ah! does nothing but hurt me. No, nope, not gonna use that guy, cause uh, what? Okay, we're gonna use that guy. Forget it. <laughs> those guys, they don't take hits. Just, just don't fall on those cracked grounds with the right armor, and we'll be fine. Late, but here was busy bringing glory to mankind. I'm so proud of you, sir. Ah! All right. Ah, there goes the heart tank. I knew it was around here. It had to be. It's the only place I didn't check. Yeah! All right, now we're ready for rumbling. Save and continue. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, time for Garrett. Near Automata, in case you didn't re get the reference. I have not played that game, it is on my queue list. Sorry. I heard it's amazing. Oh, they did a good job! They did a good job! Baldi, are you here? <laughs> they did a good job with this chip tune. X with his fire shots. Look at this! Look at this! I'm afraid to dash because of the screen crunch. God dang, this X just ripping house. The double chips for his buster just it makes it unreasonable to fight him. Two shots, two regular shots to the back of the head. Emotionally scarring game, I love it. I heard. I did not mean to jump out of there, but that worked out. Ah! All right, these bats are winning. Hmm. 
Last time I went to the path on the left, I'll go to the path on the right this time, see what that's about. That water pressure is rough. Ah, jerks! Not enjoying the water pressure. Can't hit him through there. Oh, but I get hit in the back of his bullet. All right, X, let's rock. Ow. <gasps> Scary! <laughs> Alright, buddy. That guy took a whole charge shot with my plus three, and he was like, nah, I don't care. That's not fair! I bought the dang game three times, PS4 Switch, and now Steam playing on my new Steam Deck. Got more endings and stuff done on Steam than the others, ah. That's because it's a little bit more mobile. I'm surprised, though, that the Switch wasn't the one that you got to play on. Uh oh. You're loving that Steam Deck. Good for you, buddy. All right! I don't know who this boss is, but we're gonna bank it. And I don't know if I should do it as X or Zero. I'm gonna do it as Zero. I'm gonna do it as whoever needs to be in the in the fight at the moment. It's Belgauder! I forgot. I'm so happy they have Belgauder in here. He's definitely harder to fight as Zero. But he's over there being a dumb dog, fighting nothing. Where are you fighting, you silly doggy? Good night. If only he wasn't a resurrected zombie. Ba -da -ba. Gareth. So with the X run through, we were fighting against Belkana. I, I keep almost saying Belkana because the instruction manual is mistranslation. All right, now I feel like there is absolutely a secret path that I can't reach up here. Now, I couldn't do it with X. Can I do it with zero? I doubt it because I don't see anything that gives me extra mobility in the air. This is a horrible way to pet a dog. <laughs> yes! Melgari doesn't deserve that. Ow. Gotcha! The benefit about playing Extreme 2 is that these guys don't respawn, so that's nice. I touched it! I touched it! Oh wait, they do respawn! What is this? No! This is like pixel perfect jumping. Screw you, bat! I want that health because you hit me. Wait, was it here? Alright, that's not the spot. Dang it! I have been betrayed! Where is the spot? Now I'm lost. <laughs> ah, fish sticks. I don't... Am I crazy? There it is. That's the spot. There's a bat there for a reason. Maybe I can freeze him and use him as a platform. Is there anything I can do to freeze these bats? Absolutely not. Stop being a jerk bat. Where did you come from? Ah, fish sticks. Argh! There's a good chance I'll do extreme mode, depending on if the story elements are not there. If their story elements I'm thinking of are missing, I'm absolutely going to do extreme mode. Because I think you only get the true ending on extreme mode. But if this game ends after the Gareth run, 
I may just go to X4 after this. I hate you. I hate you, you silly little bat. How does one get there? I'm gonna try some nonsense. I knew that wouldn't work. Oh my god, that worked. Oh my god, that worked. Okay. That, I can't believe that worked. All right. Then we're probably going to do another run through in extreme mode. What was this for? What am I fighting for? I did all that for nothing. <laughs> Back to the fight. I think this is better as zero. Nope, that hurt. Coward. Woo! Double coward. I'm smarter than you guys. I use iframes. frames. Ha ha ha! Oh, this is definitely an X part. Colonel's gonna be very upset to hear that, though. Three! Three regular buster shots with the plus three buster. Absurd power! I don't even need a charge of attacks! Why do I need a charge? For what? I am almighty! Coward! I can't even see my own buster shots! Ooh, I want that. Ah! <laughs> Colonel Shadows. Yep, he's mad. He's already upset. Oh, fish sticks! Woo! No! Oh my god, I can't believe I survived! Let's go! Oh no! Woo! We are we are playing a dangerous game right now. Bro, you cannot be like this. You are a jerk! <laughs> You're a master level jerk! We survived, that's what matters. Ah. All right, if this is the boss I think it is, with the super buster shot that I have as X, they're not gonna have a good time. Oh, it is. Let's just switch so we can get this thing to back off a little bit. Super violent. Zero final! Uh... No, 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 not what I want. Do I have the Giga Crush? The Giga Crush is not charged up! Zero, push him back, push him back! Ah, get him away! How does pushing him back also push back the... the missiles? That doesn't make any sense. That was so much easier this time than the first time I fought him. I'm a 
profession. Alright, before we go on, let's see what the parts list is. No new parts, Iris! Why are you such a disappointment? What are all these question marks? I don't like unknowns. Alright. Onward. Gareth time! I anticipated that you would make it this far. I will delete both of your souls. Oh, will you? Will you now? Will you, sir? Sir! 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 Can you delete both of our souls? Are you capable? I don't even need to charge up. They're so crazy strong. True ending, go to YouTube. Just start X4 and actually stop it. That's not the way we do Mega Mondays. No. Your reputation is well earned. Sorry about the unworthy games. But just so you know, they were Berkana's idea. How dare you use the word unworthy? How many Reploids have been sacrificed in your evil plan? Do not misunderstand me. It was an honor for them to have been chosen as experimental samples. It is as honorable as it gets for mean-spirited replicants. I'm wasting my time talking to you. I'll finish you within the, uh, the blink of an eye! Burkana and Gareth used to give me so much trouble as a wee little tyke. Burkana was still a problem! And you'll see why if you saw the previous episode. It's just... The, the, the way that you attack her doesn't make sense, and the, there's a thing you hit her, it makes it look like she's taking damage, but she's not. And it's just, Burkana was rough. This is not over yet. Why don't you come to Gareth's or my room so we can relax and talk? My room is above here, while Gareth's is below. The decision is up to you. Are they running away again? I'll follow them wherever they go. X, let's separate here. Okay, I'll take Burkana. See you later, X. Ah, Zero Iris. Zero, stop a minute and think about this. If you separate, you are walking into their trap. Why don't you fight together? You don't need to worry about. You don't need to worry. Even though we are far away, I have a feeling that I've been protected by his power. We'll get through this. I can't do a combo with the ultimate blade, but doesn't matter because that thing is super powerful. Ow! I already miss X and his super strong X Buster. I miss my X boy. Oh! Why don't you? Why don't any of you drop any health, you jerks? What? Thank you. Why can't you guys be cool like that little bee thing? Ah! I thought that was a wall, and I noticed what it was way too late. Gareth is gonna give me trouble, I know it. Ugh. Ah. Very nice, very, very, very tricky. Jerk, come back! Don't run away! That's not fair. How was I supposed to know that was even a thing? I was up here by luck. Not fair. How am I supposed to deal with that? You know what? Forget you. I'm just gonna wait. Let's go. Ah! Oh my god. There's like. Not enough warning for that thing. And I bet you that's electrified, so you can't even touch it. It doesn't push, just push you back. It, like, kills you instantly. Like, there's no telegraph of where to go here. I'm just gonna do a leap of faith. Ah, these dang things. And they turn around so quickly. Ah! 
It's not fair that a whole another set of drills comes out even though they're empty when you... Like, that should be the ideal time to take them out, but no, you still get a new set of drills. I hate those mechanoids. Ooh, this is an evil little... Oh, my... <laughs> There's an evil little platforming. All right. X, protect me. <laughs> ah. Ah. Now we have to go like through this six hour conversation because these guys don't shut up. Blah, 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 we blah, blah. Boy, oh boy, you guys sure do talk a lot. The art is amazing though. I really do like the little screenshots. Like this is nothing because like they use that like an X4. The mug shots are not like a big deal, but then we got that little back-to-back -back scene with X and Zero. It's super cool. There we go, like that. Thank you. Thank you for giving me control back. Let's go. Let's knock this out. Not... Well, I was going to ignore... That's what happens when you're greedy, Gran. I thought I had enough time with the iframes, but the slowdown, I guess, distorted my perception of the time. Bro, you guys need to stop abusing me. But never mind, just keep just keep hitting me. I'll just cry about it. The placement of some of these enemies is just vicious. even though it's almost over. <laughs> Better late than never, though. Thanks for coming by, Tempo. We are up to the final stage of Extreme 2 on the Zero Line. Alright, so where did I die? God, I hate those mechanoids. Ignoring you! Sorry, I was organizing a meetup with a bunch of shy furries. If I recall correctly, the ending is Legends 3 is cancelled. Um, not sure what you're trying to say there, Colonel, but yes, Legends 3 was cancelled. Oh, fish! Oh, ah, I thought I could make that, that, that thread. God, I hate those mechanoloids. Have I told you guys that yet? I really hate those mechanoids. This is like a reverse pathing of what X had to do. Kind of awesome, but still very messed up. That's not fair, man. There's not. There's too much screen crunch. How was I supposed to know there was a death pit? Ugh. All right, whatever. We know now. How else were we to know? Why did I go that way? I don't know. Listen, sir, you need to stop. Fine, just keep doing that. Ah! Wow, your jewel goes far. There we go, we're good. Ugh, I hate those drills. Okay. Look! <laughs> we are! That was pure luck! <laughs> Ugh. 
We were not going to beat Gareth on the first time, but we were absolutely going to try. But speaking of Gareth, there's our boy on the scene. And Gareth has his own little lion, which unfortunately never makes his appearance in the game. Uh, but there's a lot of art of it. Well, not a lot, just that the one. I think he might like make a momentary appearance when you walk in the door, but he does nothing. There should have been a fight with him, but there wasn't. But anyway, Gareth! What does the Maverick Hunter Field Guide say about our bad boy Gareth? Our noble knights! A, B, C, D, E, F, and G. Gravity Beetle. Gate. Gareth! Alias is not applicable. Affiliation, Mavericks, Soul Eaters. Soul Erasers, why did I think Soul Eaters? Weapon, Beam Javelin. Known weaknesses, Rising Z-Saber Technique. Oh, that's useful to know because this is gonna be a vicious fight. So I'm gonna, I'm absolutely gonna wanna employ um, weaknesses. Colonel Shadow Edge, Noble. Yes, Noble, because he thinks what he's doing is right. And he thinks that all the Mavericks that he's erasing all the Reploids that he's erasing are evil. Uh, rumored to have been created by the Reploid researcher, Burkana. Gareth was the knight to her witch. At her command, he was in part responsible for instigating the Erasure incident. He claimed to erase the DNA souls from evil Mavericks. But it would transpire that he, had, that he and Burkana were actually using DNA souls to create items that would grant them more power. Gareth pitted Hunters X and Zero against eight Guardians. Last Hornet, Flame Mammoth, Launch Octopus, Neon Tiger, Overdrive Ostrich, Tunnel Rhino, Bolt Catfish, and Wire Sponge, who were established around Lagoo's Island. Each a fallen Reploid resurrected through the use of stolen DNA souls from other Reploids. Only once they were defeated did Gareth step up to face the Hunters himself, ultimately meeting his end testing his skills against Zero. Or soon to? Gareth boasted a high attack power and objective decision making skills. His primary form of offense was to leap and hurl his beam corsec. Corsecu? I don't know that word. At his foes, returning it to his hand via teleportation. He defended himself from attacks with his beam shield. He also had a lion mechanoid, which reportedly followed him loyally yet did not take part in any encounters. Send him back to the Middle Ages. <laughs> All right, CK. Let's take him down. Hopefully I can do it in one try because I've got one life and his stage was not fun. <clears throat> oh, very impressive. No more words. Let the battle begin. Wow, these guys really don't talk. I like that. This is straight to cutthroat battle. Let's go. Ow! Oh! Did not exp- Ah! Oh! He's- Okay. I see how this works now. Alright, bro. You need, to, you need to be a bit more reasonable because you are being pretty unreasonable. Okay, here we go. take a risk and use the sub tank because uh that was not using the sub tank Ren because I think I can beat him I have I have faith I can beat him zero final go yeah zero final was the right move all right so far he is a world easier than Burkana Jerk. Ow! He blocked! Stop blocking, you jerk! One more hit. Woo! That was right on my butt. Ah, that hit me. Come on, we can do this. Just need to hit this jerk one more time. Stop being. Okay! Alright! Earth Geyser! That did no damage. Zero. Like my name. 
Get up in the air, you jerk. I swear, if he beats me with two points of health, I'm gonna be very mad. You... What a jerk! Dude, that was so unfair. It was so super duper not fair. What a jerk, dude. What a massive jerk. He wouldn't stick around to fight. All right, fine. Uh, I'm very frustrated. God, I forgot how much of a jerk this one is. Yeah, dude, at least Burkana stuck around. Oh, right, this five-hour conversation. At least they don't have a long conversation when you fight. Like, all right, let's fight. All right, let's go. That's cool. I like that. That was really cool. But, man, I just need to hit him one more time. I think it's really cool that he had a bunch of blocks like he was defending. Like, I couldn't just straight up fight him, so I had to use strategy. If I had known that ahead of time, I wouldn't have put myself at risk to get that last hit. I took some hits trying to put in that last hit. I shouldn't have done that. I should have played it more carefully, but I I had no idea he was just going to be so effective at blocking. Um, so that's very cool. Um, but now I know, and knowing is half the battle, and I got no sub tank, and that's that. I took the risk! Alright, alright. Could you come down, sir? I never air dash so much. It's because dashing is so much more difficult in this game because of the controls. No! Don't be a jerk, don't be a jerk, don't be a jerk! Come on. Like, if there was a weapon that could destroy the drills... <gasps> I knew that was gonna happen as soon as I saw how close I was to the edge! Ah, fish sticks. I was hoping I would actually get, like, iframes from getting hit by his drill. The one time I want your silly drills to hit me! Your silly, unfair drills! Pressed the jump button to do an air dash so that I'd fall to, so that I'd dash to safety, and I pressed it when he touched the ground. So I jumped into the dang thing. Air dashing shouldn't be the same button as jump. I mean, I, but they're limited with their button options in this game, so I understand. So I can't be that mad. I'm really not that mad. I'm mad at myself more than anything else. Ah, fish sticks. That's really messed up, like, layout. They definitely shouldn't have done that. Because if there was more, like, vertical view, that'd be fair. Not enough vertical view. Alright, let's go. 
I appreciate you guys not having a long conversation. It's very, very cool of you. Get him with the zero final! Ow. What happened to your safe states? I don't use that unless I, like, unless there's, like, ow! Unless the game is, like, un absolutely unfair, I try not to use safe states. Because I want to give, like, the original experience. You are a massive jerk! You know that, Gareth? You got me so many times, I'm just gonna start to learn, you jerk. Ha ha ha, block that. I think I have enough for another zero final. Bro, he ran away immediately. He knew what I was planning to do. Dodge this, jerk. Oh, he's dead! I mean, he didn't die. Good. Well, you should have used the save state behind Garrett Thor. I disagree. Fight me. Listen, when I was a kid, save states weren't an option. I'm playing in a Game Boy Color, all right? If you die, you go back, you deal with the pain. All right, that's what we did. That's what we endured, and we did it together like a family. <laughs> and I still took Gareth down with zero health, zero lives. After the battle, Zero assisted in releasing the DNA souls. Now, the Reploid will return to normal. He has no doubt that X has finished his mission now. Zero and X have faced and fought through many difficulties together. As long as X is with him, Zero can do anything. Though he doesn't express it, Zero believes with his, all his heart. This is something that will never change. You hear that, Colonel? Zero believes in X. With all of his heart! Alright. So that was the Zero Path of the Mega Man X Stream 2 gameplay. We finished just five minutes over time, but that's not a big deal. We've done longer. Uh, we try not to go over the nine minute, the nine hour mark for uh, these runs with 9, 9 p.m. EST is what I mean. Um, but uh, again, the game played very well. There's only one very tiny minor problem I had with the Zero gameplay, and it was that little drop right before Zagarat's door. Uh, the screen crunch is too unreasonable to let that be a good way to put that part of the platforming stage. Yeah, because he needs the good side of the coin. Step coin. Great job! You have cleared two missions. You deserve a special A-level hunter. But still, I feel uneasy. I wonder if we really did restore peace. What the... So I don't get... I don't get a save? Oh, extreme mode right there, ladies and gentlemen. Extreme mode. So... Extreme mode will allow us to play through the game with all eight Mavericks available to us and whoever you defeat the Maverick with that is the skill that the Maverick Hunter That that Maverick Hunter will get that skill. So you can't share skills. So we gotta be selective on who gets what I'm okay with zero getting everything and X just having that mega buster that mega ton X buster because he's just broken as all heck So that's probably gonna do and with the extreme mode. We are gonna get more story so uh, as much as it is to Colonel Shadow Edge's chagrin, X4 is still going to be postponed for at least one episode, maybe two, depending on how long it takes to get through it. But considering we went through the Maverick Hunter Field Guide on both these runs, we won't be going through the lore for Extreme Mode, so we can just blast through like professionals. All right, guys. Anyway, we're going to put this away for now, and we're going to uh, bring this back. All right, so that was Mega Man Extreme 2 Zero Run. Last week we did the X Run, and I know many of you were not here because it was a holiday. I am happy you guys were not here and you were enjoying your holiday. Good for you guys. See you next Monday, CK. Thank you, CK. See you next Monday. So if you guys want to see how the true ending of Mega Man Extreme 2 plays out, and if you want to see the true experience of Mega Man Extreme where all eight Maverick bosses, which honestly, that's the way it should always be. All eight bosses. I do like that they broke it up. It gives the game replayab uh, replayability. 
and it gives you a, a, a reason to keep playing the game. Again, back in the day, they didn't have DLCs. This is the closest thing we got. So, I do think we can get through the next... The extreme run in one one sitting. I believe in it. I believe in myself. You guys should believe in me too. So I'll see you guys next week on Mega Mondays to take down this problem of the erasure incident once and for all. All right, navigators, operators, and spotters, I will see you next week on Mega Mondays at 7 p.m. EST. If you haven't already, follow me if you enjoyed what you see. If you are watching me on Twitch and you follow me, you get some free emotes that you can take to wherever you want to go show those off if you want to subscribe you get some premium emotes and it helps the channel and if you guys are seeing this a week later on youtube make sure you like subscribe and comment and if you're gonna dislike at the very least leave a comment and let me know why what can i do better how can i bring you a smile all right guys i'll see you next week on mega monday 7 p.m est same time same place rock on